Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar and this is another episode from the Amazon Review Series. And we've got another package in today. As you can see right here, it does say Evister. And uh, this is actually a digital recorder. Um, let's go ahead and uh, pull it out. We'll kind of go over it. All right, so here we go. We've got quite a few pieces to this. I did not expect this much stuff. And I got this one specifically because it has a jack to uh, put an external mic on. What's actually really cool and I didn't expect is that it actually comes with an external mic as well as all of these other pieces here. So let's kind of go through some stuff real quick here. Obviously we have the manual here and as you can see it is fairly small but it is very very thick. Now we have one here. This is a uh, basically a line in jack. Uh, so it is a stereo end here and a stereo end here, so you can hook this up to uh, something that is going to play music or something else, and it can, of course, record it that way. You have uh, actually a short uh, telephone cable here. This is uh, the actual four-pin telephone cable, the RJ11. Uh, then have the lapel mic here. Uh, we then have, uh, this is just a USB cable. Uh, this is a digital recorder, so it does record in a digital format. Unlike some of the other models that are out there, they, they uh, save digitally because they don't use a tape or something like that, but they don't actually uh, do it in such a way that you can just transfer it from one device to another, uh, like uh, transferring uh, between your phone and your computer or something like that. So you do have a USB that uh, will do the transfer for you. Uh, and then there's a, well, looks like a fairly cheap set of, uh, of headphones. Uh, and then you also have this little device. And as you can see, there are two jacks for uh, the uh, phone cables. And then there is a jack on the back. Uh, now, first thing I'm going to mention about this is this thing's very heavy. And I don't say that as a negative thing, because really, I this thing is an entirely metal chassis, meaning this entire thing, all of basically everything that you see here that's white is metal. And uh, so it gives it some nice weight. Um, of course, extra weight usually makes you think that it is uh, of a higher quality. So we'll kind of see, get into that uh, here in a little bit. Uh, we'll kind of zoom in a little bit on this, uh, but first off, we'll go ahead over some of the features on this. This does record in stereo, so hence the two microphones there. So you've got a left and a right microphone. Uh, this does have, again, a microphone input as well as a uh, headphone jack. And uh, of course, that microphone will also do line in. So uh, same thing as what you would use for the uh, telephone recording. You then have uh, two different selections here. You have a little slider switch. It does have a music, which is a play mode, and then you have the DVR, which is more of the record mode. Then you have a uh, simple hold button, which will kind of lock the screen so that you don't accidentally press any buttons. Uh, it looks like uh, this thing here is an A and B button, which is usually kind of a folder select. You have an A folder and a B folder. Uh, and then you have, a, uh, of course, the USB connection right there, which is a micro USB, pretty standard for uh, a lot of cell phones and things like that right now. Uh, there is an erase button right here. There is the volume up and down. And then there is a selector switch, which will go between the mic telephone and line uh, so the telephone and line in I'm sure are going to be both this one and then the microphone is going to be these two uh, basically internal microphones there now uh, the buttons on the front here you have a menu button here you have a play pause a stop button here then there is a rewind or fast rewind uh, or skip and then you have uh, then the verses on that, the uh, fast forward, uh, fast play, uh, or, or skip, skip ahead. And then you also have the record button down there. Uh, now the speaker is right here so that you can, uh, of course, hear it. Okay, so we press the play button to turn it on, or at least that's one of the buttons you can use to turn on. 
and it actually already has some information on here. It already has two video or audio files. And what's very cool, uh, you can see the little screen here. We will zoom in on this in just a second. What's very cool, it actually tells you uh, uh, the artist and everything. Uh, it tells you the album. So it kind of like an MP3 player. I, I believe this is kind of the way this one's set up. Let's go ahead and play it and see what their little message is on there. Thanks for purchasing a Vista series products. If you meet any issues, please feel free to contact us via email support at ivista.com or visit our website www.ivista.com we will reply to you within 24 working hours okay welcome to use everstar voice recorder we provide excellent customer service for our customers join our elite vip club absolutely free now and register your product warranty open your browser and start here enter www Let's go ahead. We're going to go ahead and flip through. I'll uh, bring the camera in so we can get a better picture of uh, the screen here. And uh, we can kind of take a look and see what this looks like uh, as we flip through some of these. Of course, I don't want to take too much time because uh, I don't know how this looks like it has quite a few uh, different menus and things like that. So we'll flip through, see the basic idea of it, and uh, kind of get going with this. So as you can see here, this is the unit up close. You can see the buttons on the side there, and then the ones on the other side, and then there's what the back looks like. So to uh, turn it on, what I did was uh, I just pressed the little button here, and that's the power play. As you can see, it comes up, it shows the information there. Uh, now I was looking at it and I played with it while I was uh, we were getting the camera set up here and I found a couple little things. Uh, first off, this is the DVR slash uh, music button. So if I flip it up, we then go to the, uh, the kind of DVR settings, but there's nothing recorded on it. Uh, so we can go here and press record. Testing, 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 one, two, three. Testing, testing, testing. And yeah, that's uh, that's pretty clear. It was uh, almost the same volume as I'm at, which is uh, I, I think this is uh, this is set all the way up. So uh, the volume that it's set at is roughly the volume that I'm speaking at uh, in terms of playback. So uh, and then as you can see, it will flip through, tell you the information. It's recording at uh, as MP3 which I believe it does MP3 and uh, WMA, or no, I, it's WAV files, WAV. Uh, and then this recorded at 128 uh, kilobits. So you can uh, see that right there. And uh, anyhow, so let's go ahead and kind of flip through this. We've got the menu button here, and uh, we've got the tools, we've got settings, and let's see, there is the Explorer button, or there's the Explorer uh, function there, which I believe is being able to pick out the different uh, ones that you want to listen to or whatever. Uh, basically just like on an MP3 player when you flip through your songs. Uh, let's see, that one there is going to be your play settings, so I'm sure it's going to ask about uh, how you want to listen to your music. And then we've got the recording scene, which I'm sure will kind of control how it records different things. You have your noise reduction. And let's see, then we're back to tools again. If you guys want to check this out, you can go down there in the description below. We will have a link to this on the Amazon site as well. We have our social media down there. And on your way down or on your way back up, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. And uh, along with that, if you haven't done so already, hit one of the little buttons uh, here in either of the corners or down below. Uh, those are for subscribing. If you haven't done that and uh, you want to know when we've got new videos coming out, make sure you hit that bell icon down there. That, of course, will let you get notified of when we've got new videos coming out here on World of Me. 
Alright guys, well my name's Cougar, this is another episode from the Amazon Review Series here on World of Me. I would like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye!